This CD was made for our very good friends in Mannheim, Germany. Hope you enjoy it. Sons of Scotland, I am William Wallace. William Wallace is seven feet tall. Yes, I've heard. He kills men by the hundreds. And if he were here, he'd consume the English with fireballs from his eyes and bolts of lightning from his arse. <laughs> I am William Wallace. And I see a whole army of my countrymen here in defiance of tyranny. You've come to fight as free men. And free men you are. What will you do without freedom? Will you fight? Fight against that? No! We will run! And we will live. Aye. Fight and you may die. Run. And you'll live. At least a while. I'm dying in your beds many years from now. Would you be willing to trade all the days from this day to that for one chance, just one chance, to come back here and tell our enemies that they may take our lives, but they'll never take our freedom! See 
sweet talk, sweet talk, whisper sweet things in your ears. I'm gonna tell you lots of things that I know that you've been longing to hear. Come on, little darling, take my hand. Let's go for a little walk under the moon of love. Let's sit down and talk. She had a big garden, although they were really quite poor. One of the residents called her a sweetheart, the way she looked after her folks. Her father was minging, he'd give you the sweet violets, sweeter than the roses, covered all over from head to toe. Covered all over with sweet violets The farmer she worked for was quite thrilled to bits Cause just like the miner he'd noticed her Earrings and trained her to run in his farmstead The farmer was eager to get her to Like him and put her in charge like a fool Cause one day he found she'd been milking the Prophets and made herself really quite rich. He called her a strumpet, he called her a sweet violet, sweeter than the roses, covered all over from head to toe, covered all over with sweet violets. The next day the farmer was all teeth and smiles. Explained he got angry because he had problems and asked if she liked to be kissed. The young girl refused cause she knew he was puggled. He sat her and called for a taxi. She told him to shove his job right up his jumper because she was happy to quit. She built it in one and he fell in the sweet violets. Sweeter than the roses, covered all over from head to toe, covered all over with sweet violets. And so she returned to the boy in Loch Gilly and offered her love and her rather large bank book. The young miner knelt to propose. 
then Wintink and Butter a ring for her. Finger and with it he offered his heart. She got so excited she let off a firework to celebrate their wedding day. From that day till this day have rolled in the sweet violets. Sweeter than the roses, covered all over from head to toe, covered all over with sweet violets. Boys, you will never fly alone. 